You saved her! Oh, you really are the best. Here, take this power cell. I won't need it now that I have my inspiration back. Contribution? Good. A, a sizable one, I hope. You! Yes. <laughs> oh, it is a sizable contribution. I, well, 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 I, I just hope this power cell adequately represents my gratitude. You two are back to make the trade. Good, good, jolly good. Hey, you have the uh, precursor orbs that we agreed on? I hope you put this hard-earned power cell to good use. Cheerio, ta-ta, bye-bye. needed to power my heat shield. Now be careful. The shield will only protect your zoomer till it reaches 500 degrees, so try to keep her cool. Flying over open lava will definitely heat you up fast. Hit 500 degrees and it's over. Over? Like burning molten metal over? The fire canyon gets pretty hot, so keep a lookout for jumps to keep you off the hot ground. I've also released several blue cooling balloons you can use to drop the shield's temperature quickly. Oh, and when you get across, don't forget to activate the teleport gate in the Blue Sage's lab. Then we'll be able to teleport over and meet you. Good luck!
don't think I'll ever get used to that teleporter tingling sensation. Hey! It looks like the Blue Sage threw a party. Oh my! Rock Village is on fire! One heck of a party. No, no! I mean Rock Village is being bombarded with flaming boulders! Oh! And it looks like the Blue Sage is working on a levitation machine to move them. Assuming it's operational, we're gonna need power cells to fuel it. I guess you two are going to have to find some ore. We'd better take a look at his notes. Jack, go check on the villagers, then come back and give us an update. And take the furball with you. Oh, <laughs> 